Welcome back to Extravagant Fragrances, everybody. Fragrance of the day. Today's fragrance is actually two fragrances, two particular fragrances that bring back a lot of uh, nostalgic memories. And those two fragrances is going to be Tommy Hilfiger and also Vanilla Fields. Um, now, Tommy Hilfiger, the reason why these two kind of go hand in hand is just because when I was back in junior high, I would say all the popular kids, they all wore either Vanilla Fields, if you was a girl, and you was popular, you was wearing Vanilla Fields, if you was a guy, and you were popular, you was wearing Tommy Hilfiger, and that's just the way it was. The guys, they would carry Tommy Hilfiger everywhere they went. I'm talking, and you know, uh, they'd carry it to the gym class, they'd have it on the bus, they'd have them in their backpacks, everything. And they always had that fragrance with them. It was like they were attached to their Tommy Hilfiger. And it, you know, for good reasons. I mean, I think it's a timeless scent. I think it's, uh, it smelled modern at that time, and I think it, it's still a fragrance that still smells modern until now. Uh, one of the notes that I pick up from it is a slight, slight nutmeg. Somewhere in there, it smells like a slight nutmeg. Now, I don't know all the notes to this fragrance, but that's just what I'm picking up. Uh, now, Vanilla Fields, on the other hand, that was one of those fragrances that just lingered. I mean, that fragrance was truly, if you know what I'm talking about, if you guys and girls know what I'm talking about, Vanilla Fields truly was a very seductive fragrance in my opinion uh, and I would say even it probably made some of the most unattractive girls look extremely attractive uh, <laughs> that's just that's just how it was I, I don't know if it's just you know all the girls that seem like they were attractive were wearing this fragrance or maybe they just looked attractive because they were wearing this fragrance I don't know if the fragrance caused that kind of uh, deception on the on, on a person's eyes or what uh, but that's what it seemed like it just seemed like all the all the good looking girls uh, as far as back as junior high and high school they all they all seem to wear this fragrance uh, but vanilla fields if you look it up on eBay that I want to say the bottle there is the original like there's I think it's going through some changes if I'm not correct like and that might have been a that might have been changes in the actual bottle, but I don't know how much it's changed from the the scent. And that fragrance is a very very timeless scent. Uh, even till now, if if somebody wears that now, like you would never know that that fragrance has been around for you know twenty plus years. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know if it's discontinued. There's a lot of uh, you know, great fragrances out there that have come out in the past that actually are discontinued. I don't know if Vanilla Fields is one of them, but I'd like to get my hands on that one. If there's any of the, my female uh, subscribers, if that fragrance is still around, let me know. Uh, I'd be interested in checking that out and revisiting that fragrance. Uh, but that's it, guys. Uh, Vanilla Fields and Tommy Hilfiger. Two awesome fragrances of the day. Until then, I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.